Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we're trying the Fenty Beauty glosses. We're gonna be doing some swatches. I love these glosses and I actually lost my one, the original shade, the universal one. They actually came out with a new uh, Heat Hot Cherry. This is a universal lip luminizer and plumper. It has an uh, instant plumping and warming effect. It's shimmer-free, sheer red color, hot cherry. I might wear it today, you know. Lush, smooth texture with conditioning shea butter. Um, and vitamin E to help lock in moisture. I think it has like pepper or something in it. So I'm gonna first try the other shades because I got a few shades here. I've got the gloss bomb cream and the, some other shades of the gloss bombs. We'll swatch these first and then lastly, I'll try the hot cherry one. Do you know what? It was Fenty Glow I think that I had. I remember I queued up. I queued up for like an hour when Fenty first released in Harvey Nichols and I got um, this one and this is like so good it was in my bag and I just lost it and it was like halfway down so today's post inspiration shout out is going to Avantika Y so thank you so much for your really sweet comment I really appreciate it and if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button and then let me know in the comments below when you've done so it's got a mix of pepper and ginger root that instantly plumps and I wonder what the shade's gonna look like on me. I've never worn like that kind of glossy shade. The first shade we have is Fenty Glow. This is uh, the gloss bomb. I feel like this shade suits everyone. Oh my God, I missed it. By the way, guys, a dupe for these glosses are the Maybelline Lifter glosses. Literally, Topaz is the dupe for Fenty Glow. Um, so yeah, in case you're looking for a dupe, these ones are just bomb. By the way, these were gifted, but obviously all opinions are my own. As always, guys, I always keep it real with you. I love doing gloss swatches because they don't damage my lips as much. Okay, so next one, we have Sweet Mouth, which is another one that I really wanted, but I just never got around to getting it. Look how beautiful. So this one's definitely a clear gloss for me, but I would definitely top this on top of... Um, it looks milky kind of, but I would definitely tap top this on like a little bit of brown lip liner and then this in the center. This is it guys. They would just make your lips look so plump luscious. I got a couple shades in the gloss bomb creams. First shade is called Cookie Jar. It's like a chocolate brown. This is my first time trying the creams. Oh my God, that is so pigmented. So that's cookie jar. These are definitely pigmented. I've heard only good things about them. I think there was one called waffles, which I'll definitely grab because this is a bit dark for me, but it's a nice deep brown if you're really into that. Okay, so we've got another gloss bomb cream. This one's in the shade fruit snacks. That is so pigmented, oh my God. This is not a bad shade at all. I wanna wear red today to go out, but I think this one's a bit out of my comfort zone. Like, <sighs> that's why I'm looking forward to trying Hot Cherry because I feel like it's more wearable. Wow, this is a deep burgundy red. Um, it is gorgeous. Like, I would wear it for like a, a dinner out if I was feeling brave enough. But if you're into this type of color, like, it is so pigmented and I'm quite surprised that it's pigmented for like a gloss like this. Okay, then finally we got the Gloss Bomb Heat. This one's in Hot Cherry. Oh my God, it just looks so nice. It looks like this bubblegum bright shade. By the way, I love the packaging. Let's try this. Oh my god, it definitely smells spicy. It smells spicy. <laughs> okay, let's try this. I'm hoping I'm gonna like it. Mm. Oh my god. That literally stung me so bad. I don't know if it's because I've been rubbing my lips so much. Do you know what? I'm gonna wear this out. Today, me and my sister are going to this like really TikTok famous place that we've been seeing everywhere. And also I'm vlogging it so you guys will see it anyway. So don't worry, don't worry. But yeah, I love this. It's so wearable. It makes my lips look so juicy. I'm not looking forward to wearing this with a mask, um, but it looks nice. I'm definitely gonna bring it with me. With these, they're actually quite long wearing, but you do need to top them up like any gloss, I feel like, especially if you're gonna wear a mask, it's gonna be all up in there, man. Ugh. But um, yeah, I really like this. It definitely has this tingling sensation and I really like that because it does give that extra like plumpness to your lip. 
this tingling reminds me of the Too Faced lip injections because that's major tingling and it really plumps up my lips. Anyways, like I said in my previous videos, it's good if I'm willing to go out with it and I'm willing to go out with this shade. I love that it's wearable. I prefer it more to the darker shades. That's just like my preference. But I love this. I love that this has a like a reddish like cherry tint to it anyways that's the end of this video i really hope you enjoyed the swatches and found them helpful let me know what your favorite shade is i definitely need to grab that waffle shades because i feel like that's really up my street but yeah thank you so much for watching make sure to subscribe so you can join the family and hit the like button because it really helps your girl out and yeah i will see you in my next video bye